County recently stumbled upon a stack of mystery documents and after taking a closer look they realized they had found some very personal and likely meaningful papers. They range from a marriage license to a death certificate, even presidential letters and orders from the Army. As the family explains to Fox 13 News reporter Jennifer Lee, they are trying to track down the rightful owners. She found a treasure. Kelly Cease and her granddaughter Liana made the discovery during their evening walk. And as we were walking, I looked to the right of me, and there was a stack of paperwork that looked like a birth certificate. And I'm like, wait a minute, this is important. The documents show the personal history of a man named Philip Seda, who was born in 1917 and lived in Tacoma. The family even shows us a season's so greetings card addressed now. to Seda and his it's family. There are also special documents recognizing him for his service in the Army. He was pretty decorated from what it seems like. I mean, and he had two letters from two different presidents, Jimmy Carter and Ronald Reagan. My mom comes in and yells, Brianna, get down here, it's important. And I'm like, okay, you know, so I run downstairs and I go out to the back and on a table, she just has a bunch of papers sitting there. And I'm like, what is this? This is home surveillance video from Tuesday night and you can see the stacks of paper Cease carried home. The family lives in Parkland and found the documents near 126th Street East. But you'll see right here is where we found it. Wonder why this is here. I mean, in a field across from our home and it's just sitting there thrown into the bushes like like nobody cared. Like a family I don't I know wouldn't do that. Just take the paperwork and throw it away, you know, so and that was really that was kind of hard. Cease's own father was in the military for 27 years and she holds it dear to her heart. I have um, his dog tags, an old myself, an old military ID. I have some of his medals that are put away and I have tons of memories. You know, that's the thing, a ton of memories. The family has turned over all of the documents to a Pierce County Sheriff's deputy. We spoke with a spokesperson from the department who says considering the documents had sensitive and personally identifying information, the family absolutely did the right thing, getting in touch with law enforcement. The family should have it shouldn't be sitting on the side of a road, you know, discarded like it's nothing. In Parkland, Jennifer Lee, Fox 13 News.